In a nation that is just over 17,000 square miles, smaller than Vermont and New Hampshire combined, there are over 700 orphanages. The irony of the situation is that 85% of the kids in these orphanages have at least one living relative. There are better ways to care for these children. One option is to reintegrate the child into their birth family. Another preferred option is to provide alternative family-based care, or what Bethany Global calls foster care. Foster care is most effective when the government and local churches partner together for the sake of the children. Foster care is a great option for Haiti because of the fact that children are going to sometimes need a transition, a safe place to live, a family environment as we work towards placing them back with their family. A lot of other organizations that are doing family-based care struggle with recruitment, and that's not been something that we've had a problem with because of our partnerships with the local church. Among the 40 churches that we are partner, we have about 60 families who has been trained to become foster care. And those families, we have uh, 20 of them who are accredited by the government to be foster parents. Goodland's foster parents welcomed her into their home over eight months ago. She has become their third child. They heard about Bethany Global's program from their pastor, and they understood how they could make a difference in a child's life by becoming a foster family. They have become advocates in their community for other families to become foster homes. So Bethany has done a very serious work. I think in the community. For that? Because the work that Bethany has done there is a work that allows that Bethany allows that we, as a family, mm -hmm. nous contribuer dans faire par exemple avancer communauté avancer société a li permettre que nous prend en série des petits monde par exemple qui peut être pas tab jeune encadrement pour te ca venir un monde de merci dieu veut pour te capable venir utile société a on passe soit pas pour offre des nayo que tout petit monde qui nous offre des nayo yo joindre nos familles d'accord côté petit monde a senti yo plus intégré dans famille que yo pas côté même si gien monde qui prend soin yo mais dans famille là on passe yo tab plus ou moins sécurité aux jeunes mamans et papa pour qu'ils aient toute affection, tout l'amour que ont besoin pour évoluer. When we launched foster care over three years ago, we've spent a lot of time just training, awareness raising, and educating partners and people on the ground in Haiti that yes, family-based care is possible in Haiti. A lot of the momentum that we've seen and a lot of the success that we've experienced has really been in the last year, as finally churches and partners have come alongside of us to say, yes, we think that children do better in families. It is a big deal. It is a big milestone because it, is a, it was a long process to be accredited by the government to do foster care. The Haitian government was familiar with caring for children in orphanages only, not fully acknowledging the potential for abuse in those settings. Now, through the good work of partnering NGOs, including Bethany Global, the government understands the benefits of foster care and is seeking to place increasing numbers of children into foster families. The families that we work with in Haiti are strong and resilient, but they're also struggling. And they really are looking for the best opportunities for their children. If just down the road or in the next village over, there's an orphanage that provides three meals a day for your child and an education, a loving mom or a loving father is going to say, yes, let's bring our child to that orphanage. How can we help address some of those complex issues so that families don't have to make those difficult, difficult choices? So the family preservation program that we run is focused on families. It's different than your normal child sponsorship program because we really want that whole family to thrive. We know that kids survive and thrive so much better in a family. Bethany Global's Family Preservation Program is a five-year relationship that begins by helping provide a family with daily necessities so that they can live together and send their children to school. 
In the last two years, the focus is on empowering the family to be self-sustaining, ensuring the children go to school without any further assistance or intervention from Bethany Global. Mina's story of empowerment tells of the impact of family preservation. Mina was a business owner, but lost everything in the 2010 earthquake. Avant tout là, oui, nous devons dormir dans nos chèques en bas, dans la cour des bises en bas, mon nom. Non, le bâton boit ce que j'ai, ça a été un abdomen dans l'arrière. Il s'est venu à nous faire un peu de difficulté, parce qu'on y a nos gays espoirs. Nos gays espoirs, quand même. Nos gays espoirs, dans les années, parce que chaque mois, depuis que nous arrivons là, nous avons fait des boudoirs qui arrivent là, nous. Family preservation works to keep families like Mina's together. Bethany Global comes alongside them to reach their goals, assisting with issues like economic empowerment. This assistance is possible because Bethany's family sponsorship model has proven effective to provide resources for the family preservation work in Haiti. The exciting thing about our family sponsorship model is that it allows us to help support not just one child in the family, but the entire family. Churches in the U.S. and families in the U.S. through our family sponsorship model can come alongside a family in Haiti to help them come together, stay together, and thrive. In the last six months, I have seen so much movement towards family-based care in Haiti. Orphanages who never before wanted to have a conversation about deinstitutionalization or getting their children into foster care are now coming to our door and saying, help us, please, we want to do what's in the best interest of children. We're seeing the government on board and a true partner with us in the programming work that we're doing. God is using people to create a better future for, for people in Haiti. That's why we invest in children, we invest in families, because when we invest in children and families, we will contribute to change the way they are living. Changing the way they are living is a process of changing the nation. The future is bright for Haiti. We've seen more momentum in the last year than we have in 10 years. The bigger vision that we have is a interconnected network of families and government partners working alongside the church to help provide safe, loving families for children. The future will be better and the nation will be changed. Strong, whole families will make for a stronger, more whole Haiti. Foster care, family preservation, and family sponsorship are necessary tools to make that a reality.